Hi guys, so for this week's vlog, I decided to do a makeup tutorial and I am no, by no means a makeup artist. Um, I normally do, I, no, I don't normally do makeup. I don't normally do makeup. I usually just do like mascara and stuff like that. But today is my brother's graduation, so I am going to do a little makeup tutorial um, for that and my look getting ready for that. Also, I've always wanted to try a voiceover, so for this video, the whole time I'm going to be silent, putting on my makeup, and then I'm going to speak into it and voiceover, and I'm super excited for that. So, let's get started! Hi guys, alright, so I'm super excited to do this voiceover. I have L'Oreal Paris 24 Hour Foundation Infallible Glow 204 Natural Buff. And I don't know, really know where to put it. This is kind of, I don't normally use foundation, so I just kind of put it all over my face. Um, I dab it on with a sponge thing, and mine's purple, and I really like it. I got it at, I think I got it at Marshalls for like two bucks. Um, and a lot of this makeup I've had for forever, and I know that's probably not good, but yeah, I pattered it, pat, pat it all over my face, um, and yeah, it's, I try, I've seen some videos where they like dab, 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 so I guess I copied them, I don't know, but, um, I, I always think, uh, you know, it looks good. Then I use this, uh, CoverGirl concealer that I, my mom got me, and I kind of put it under my eyelids because I I have very dark circles. I mean, crazy dark circles. So I um, dab it in, dab it in, and coming up is a little bit of a transition because my dad interrupted me. But I use Aveeno uh, Clear Complexion uh, uh, Moisturizer. And right now I'm looking around for my eyebrow stuff. I use Naked the Basic Palette, and I actually use eyeshadow on my eyebrows. My roommates in Florida actually gave me that idea. I also use this brow powder stuff that I got from Ipsy because I needed Ipsy to show me some new things, and I'd never done my eyebrows before, so hopefully they look good for you. I am looking, when I'm looking at you guys, I'm looking at the computer but when I'm looking to the side I'm looking at a mirror and you could tell by my face that I don't really know what I'm doing um, I'm definitely an amateur makeup artist so um, I think that eyebrow looks pretty good uh, nope uh, apparently Maddie didn't think so so <laughs> I then put on the powder um, the eyeshadow powder and I switch between two I'll tell you guys right now. So it's on the basic Naked palette, and it's a toss between Naked 2 color and Faint. And I fill in my eyebrows, fill in my eyebrows. Now before this video, I definitely plucked some of my eyebrow hairs because my eyebrows get wild, but I like my eyebrows thick to be honest. And then I wipe them off because I don't want them to look like super, super thick or fake, but I don't know. That's just me. Um, so yeah, I did a little dance party there. But next, I am doing eyeliner. And let me tell you, see how I had to take a deep breath? I do not do eyeliner. I have no idea how to do eyeliner. Um, I chose this color because it can easily fade. If I would have chose black, I would have failed. But as I give the thumbs up, I would say I did a pretty decent job. Now, obviously, you're not supposed to do eyeliner before eyeshadow, and you'll see later on in the video that I redo it because I'm, again, an amateur makeup artist, and I'm sorry, guys, but, like, this is the real truth of me. Like, I have no idea. Look at how I'm adding it like a winged look. I don't know what I'm doing. I just gave the okay, and I'm like, what the heck is going on? Next, I chose this Mandala um, eyeshadow, and it's really nice. It's a really pink color, and I really like it. And I'm going to put a base on first, which is on my 
big Naked 2 palette and it's foxy. Um, I do that under my eyebrows to, because I heard that if you put a little white under your eyebrows, your eyebrows pop out. I don't know, they stand out or something like that. So I did that and yeah, the one thing that I showed you, I'm sorry guys, I am not prepared, but the eyeshadow that I'm using is called Man Mana Darkar mm, Beauty. And it's, I got it from Ipsy, and the color is Fantasy. Ooh, and I'm also doing a little bit of Booty Call color from the Naked Palette on my eyes right now. Again, don't know what I'm doing. Shouldn't have uh, put on eyeliner before uh, eyeshadow, but I did. So uh, you'll see me have to do it again, but that's what I'm doing. And so, yes, I use the Man dark bar beauty eyeshadow and it's called fantasy it's really pretty at first I wasn't gonna use my finger to put it on but like I said I've seen in some makeup videos that that's what people do so I guess I try to be like them a little bit in a way um, but uh, I don't know it's really funny because Oh, oh, that was like, a, oh, I, I swirl it, swirl it, blend it, blend it. Um, this is my first time, guys, so I'm sorry if you're not enjoying this, but I think it's really funny, actually, to do this voiceover because it's funny to watch myself back. And it's some of the faces I'm making, what was that? Was that a, like, a, I'm drawing a, oh, yes. So I like to do the bottom lashes <laughs> uh, with eyeshadow. I don't know why, I think it makes it stand out I don't know because normally I do a lot of mascara and you will see um, towards the end because I normally do mascara last but you will see that I use a lot of mascara um, also um, I'm putting on this lip scrub that I got from Ipsy as well again most of my stuff comes from Ipsy and it's like sugary and so that's why I'm looking at the camera like ooh it's good yes it's very good it's yummy because it is really good it's like lip sugar and it's called indie beauty buttercream antioxidant lip scrub so then I'm putting on my lipstick which is number 165 it's tickled pink and it's by L'Oreal Paris I I also don't really know how to put on lipstick, so I just guess, sort of, and I guess it works out for me because I think it looks good, so I hope you guys think it looks good, but if not, then I get it because, you know, I don't know, so, half the time I don't know what I'm doing, so, I know I've said that a lot in this video, but I really don't, so, that's the whole truth of it. Oh, next I am putting on that glow though highlighter so I had never ever used highlighter before and everyone apparently it was the rave so I was like okay I better try this and I got it in my ipsy thing again so um if you looks like I don't know what I'm doing I really don't and see how I use that type of brush no 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 Maddie let's use our fingers there we go blend it blend it blend it blend it yeah I don't know why I thought I would use that brush but I hope I don't have too much highlighter on I may have put too much on my forehead my dad said <laughs> I look like I have something on my forehead that's glowing and I was like oh that's highlighter dad so I don't know. It's funny because my family is not used to seeing me in full makeup because I normally just wear mascara. So, like I said, I am reapplying my eyeliner because I did it the opposite way. I did it very wrong, but I think I'm doing a good job. I mean, I hope I am. Look at me. Oh gosh, yeah, that's it, Maddie. That's it. Ooh, ooh, rock it. Rock it out. Rock it out. Um, but yeah, so my three mascaras, so I use three kinds. Mascara is my absolute favorite beauty product. I mean, I pile that stuff on like crazy. The first one I have, I use is Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. And let me tell you, it is thebomb.com because this mascara is so lit. I love it so much. And I tr do the technique where I go up and I s 
rub or not rub but I go up and I brush it brush it like brushing the hair and I kind of go in and out in and out and go up because I saw that in a makeup tutorial once so I think it works out pretty well I think it makes it so that you don't get a lot of clumps which is really nice because clumps aren't fun so there I am yep 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 I love mascara it's my favorite thing I seriously love when it's piled on and one day I'm gonna learn how to do the fake lashes because I really want to do that I actually want to get like lash extensions and if you noticed I don't use a curler and the reason why is because it freaks me out it hurts my eyes so I don't my mascara that I'm using now is by Maybelline New York it's lash lash sensational luscious full fan effect mascara and I love this stuff it's so nice so like it's just so awesome and all of the makeup all of the mascara I am using today the three are all um, normal mascara they're not waterproof I tend to notice that when I use waterproof I it pulls out my lashes and I'm sure a lot of you have noticed that as well but it definitely pulls out my lashes and I am not okay with that if you know what I mean because I need my lashes my lashes are my go-to my lashes are like my thing I need to do mascara like that's a thing I need to do so it's not okay with me if the lashes fall out because that makes me cry and so yeah so I adding the third mascara which is matte lash black mascara and I also got it from ipsy so the small bottles are tubes of mascara I got from ipsy because they're like tester mascaras and I had more um, and I actually canceled my ipsy because I just was like wow I'm getting way too much stuff that I'm not really using so I use some of it for sure, but then I'm going back with the Better Than Sex just to, you know, make it out. So pretty much I put on like four layers of mascara, which is crazy, but I love it. Um, it's my number one thing. It's my go-to thing. And I think my look is complete. Yes, Maddie, work, work. And I love my hair. Yes, pose, pose, girl, pose. But thank you for watching and... I am just so excited. Thank you, thank you, thank you.